Welcome to Talk FC Bay and welcome back here to the channel guys and welcome to the match review of Barcelona against Real Valladolid. But the very point is there's not an awful lot here to review simply because not a lot happened once again. I'm actually saying to you guys thank you for coming and watching this video simply because it was hard enough to watch that 90 minutes. And I completely would buy the argument that we were saving ourselves here for that big game on Tuesday. We've got Leon coming and usually you'd say in this sort of position maybe the players were just saving themselves holding a little bit back to really unleash it on Tuesday. And on Tuesday, maybe we will be brilliant. Maybe there'll be a complete surprise, a complete turnaround, and we'll demolish Leon or something like that. But on the basis of this, this was not saving ourselves for Leon. This was just quite simply absolutely woeful. In the first half, they didn't even try. In the first half, there was absolutely no ambition to go out there, take the lead, make some positive runs, make some quick passes. We were actually lucky if we were ready to string together about two or three passes. It simply didn't happen. Happen. And in the second half, there was a lot more intensity, there was a lot more hunger from the guys to go out there and try and score a goal. But the finishing, the final product, that is absolutely woeful right now. And what I'm seeing here is not just a bad display, this is turning into a bad few weeks. We were very poor against Valencia, we managed to come back in that game, we were mediocre against Real Madrid, we were woeful against Athletic Bilbao, not even scoring in that game. And here against Vidal at home, you heard the fans there, there's only 60 odd thousand in there tonight, they were very frustrated come the end of the game. Messi and himself was massively frustrated, got booked for arguing with the ref. It was a disappointing display. And I just don't know what's gone wrong with this team at the moment. And I'll just go back to Valverde here with regards to motivation, because in this kind of game, these are players out there who've won everything, who've dominated this league before, they've won Champions League, they've won international trophies. And in this kind of game, when you play players of quality, sometimes you need to motivate them to go out there and actually do something. In that first half, they were not motivated. These players went out there, they were just going through the motions, they were just getting by. Luckily, we got the penalty because if we hadn't got that penalty tonight guys we wouldn't have won this game because from open play it wasn't going in now in the second half like I say we tried we put a few shots on goal we put a few things in and around the penalty area but we never looked like finishing it and the major worry for me is yes we've got three points here yes you know we got out of this game with the win that we wanted but going into that Leon game you look around the confidence right now is dead and I mean absolutely dead Luis Suarez came on and I will defend Suarez and defend Suarez and defend Suarez but you look at that performance there he is not confident to score from two yards neither is Kevin Prince Boateng you know Usman Dembele started the game with substitute I thought Coutinho came on actually and did pretty well he won the penalty which Messi missed it was uncharacteristic tonight for Messi to miss that penalty there was a few shots there was a few passes that went astray but at the end of the day he was still the only one trying to make things happen every single ball was played into Messi and it was kind of that kind of display tonight wasn't it if we got the ball we're just going to find Messi and hope that he can do the rest. We can't always rely on Messi. You are world-class players around him. Go and do it on your own for once. Go and do something yourselves without having to rely always on the shoulders of Messi. And I have to say, guys, I'm really frustrated right now because I was hoping in this game, as you heard in the match preview, that we were going to go into it and get that confidence back, get that momentum back, and really get everyone going again. But it didn't happen. It didn't work like that. If anything, we're even more demoralised now we're even more dented in terms of our confidence in terms of our momentum Leon won Leon won last night it wasn't a big win for them but they got three points at home we've won here but we really are struggling right now and we're going to need a massive change not only in terms of personnel of course there's a few rotations today but we're going to need a change in attitude on Tuesday if we're going to get anything close to a positive result in France I do still believe that we can do it but tonight didn't do us any favours whatsoever we are struggling it's not just this game we weren't just saving our Ourselves. We have been now for week upon week upon week. Last week it was bad against Athletic. This week I would go as far to say even worse. That first half there was nothing going for us. The second half we turned up that intensity. There was a lot more hunger to go and win the game. But in front of goal we were shambolic. And so with that guys I'm going to put my focus on Leon. I will be back in the coming days with more videos. I hope you enjoyed the rest of your weekend and I will be back soon. Don't worry about that. But as far as this game goes Barcelona 1, Real Valladolid 0. And for once, let's just leave it there. And so, until next time, as always, Vizca El Barca. Oh!